Hello, my beautiful sweets. Sweet Sadie J coming back at you. Hope everyone's having a wonderful day. It is beautiful out here in North Kakalaki today. I'm at my car dealer getting my car service. Oh, there's no one in here, y'all. I'm at the car dealer getting my car service finally, getting the fluids checked, oil changed, tires rotated. You know, got to take care of the baby. And then um, after I leave here, I'm probably going to go to Walmart only on the pharmacy side today pick up a few vitamins and miscellaneous and then i'm going to check out small dollar tree and see if they have anything and then on my way back in i'm going to stop off um at the car wash and probably get my baby washed again because y'all know how that is got to keep her clean got to keep her taken care of i'm going to turn the camera around real quickly you guys see where i'm at the tv is a little loud right now but we'll just dismiss that but it's beautiful out it's supposed to get high in the 90s this um this week or weekend i'm not really sure i forgot but yeah it's supposed to get like july weather in may so for all of you people that love the hot weather cheers because i'm not one of them i like 70s 75 tops but yeah there's nobody in here as you can see so i don't need to wear my mask So, I know my hair's a hot mess because it didn't completely dry. And I hate when that, my hair doesn't dry. Um, but it's all good. I'm not going anywhere. Anywhere that I really care. So, I'm going home and just twist it right back up. So, it's a gorgeous day. I'm going to, when I leave here, I always stay. I never go home because I, I'm afraid I'll forget. I'm sure they'll call me and let me know. But... I almost forgot the appointment today, but I keep feeling like today is Thursday because yesterday was Tuesday, but it's Wednesday. I'm back on track. But yeah, so I'm going to click off here while I'm waiting, try to catch up on some videos that I was not able to watch yesterday and support all my family. So I will catch back up with you guys when I'm out of here. All right. Talk to you later. Bye. Okay, my sweets, I am finally out of the car dealer. I forgot to look at the clock to see how long. About an hour, a little, I had a 1.30 appointment, and it's 2.47, and I'm here at Walmart's now, so I'm getting ready to go in and pick up my few little items that I need here, and then we're going to go down there to the Dollar Tree. I know you can't see it all the way, but I'll see you inside. Y'all see how cute these pillows are? I don't need any more pillows, y'all, but these are so cute. Y'all like the farmhouse? Howdy. I think they're all $5, I believe. That's what I got my, oh, Lord, they've gone up considerably. $20. I used to get them here for $5, but I like that one down there. That's cute. But I don't need any more pillows. Oh, here's one up close with the butterflies. $20, y'all. $20. Ooh, ooh. This is so cute. Oh my God, y'all. I'm not going to do it. $20 changes the game. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, the Pioneer Woman one. Drumming. <laughs> now that's worth $20. I would pay $20 for that. Kicking back. <laughs> that is so cute. Wow. All right, let's go in. It's hot out here. Okay, I'm in Barbie heaven. Can you just say? Look at how they've changed over the years, you guys. When I was a kid, well, I wouldn't have gotten any of this anyway. We never got the original Barbies. My parents couldn't afford it. They had three girls and three boys. But look at all the stuff. Okay, let me get out of here. Jesus, this is, this is driving me crazy. I love that one right there. Y'all, I'm on my way to the food section. But look at these nice, beautiful beach bags, y'all. I love this one down here. $30, y'all. Wow. They got it in that color. The blue. That color. And the black and white. And they got all these plastic ones. $22.98. Ooh. Mm, just not my music. I do not own it. Now, I'm not sure what I want for dinner tonight. 
But I'm thinking tacos, even though it's Wednesday, not Tuesday. But I'm not sure yet. I haven't gotten any taste buds, but I'm finding this hot sauce. Well, that one's hot. This one's mild. You made my day. <laughs> for $1.34. I think that's good for tacos, right? Or I might just make a taco bowl. Not sure. El Pinto Hatch Green Chilies. They got Taco Bell, everything in here. They also have, ooh, real ranchos, tostada bowls. Yeah, but I got all these shells at home in the pantry. I really want to use them. They got the cheesy double decker taco kit for $2.52. That's not bad. <coughs> I really want to get <laughs> those bowls, but I don't want to spend no, uh, yeah, I want to pay no $5.48. I'll go home and make them myself. They got the nacho cheese, El Paso. Wow, that's pretty good. But I got all these shells at the house, so I'm trying not to waste money, y'all. Inflation, inflation. <laughs> all right. Yeah, I don't know what's going on with the regular lean ground turkey, but everywhere I go, I just can't find the regular ground turkey, all I have to find is the extra lean or the lean. So I don't know what's going on. The same thing that food line. I don't know what's happening here. So I don't know what's going on. You gotta pay a little bit more for the lean one, so <sighs> we'll keep looking. Cheers. Well, I guess you guys, I'm gonna change my plans and maybe go home and make some spaghetti. I haven't had spaghetti in a while, but I love this turkey sausage for my breakfast, but I also like a little bit of sausage in with my meat sauce. I hate to have to go to Food Lion, but I might have to, because Walmart's not hitting on anything right now. All right, I'll keep looking. Okay, my sweets, I'm on my way over here to the Dollar Tree. I've already gone over my budget, so I'm not sure if I'm going to get my car washed. And yeah, I'm probably going to do it anyway, but yeah, yeah, no, we can't go into these stores and, and not go over our budget. It's just kind of like a fantasy world when you put yourself on a budget. <laughs> oh! I laugh at myself all the time. I'm like, oh, you really thought you were going to stick to that budget, didn't you? I went into Walmart and I almost lost my daggone mind and I didn't even go to the whole store. I did end up going over to the food side, but they didn't even have my ground turkey. I'm mad. I'm like, Miss Emma, I'm mad. <laughs> I'm mad they didn't have my ground turkey because I was going to have spaghetti or tacos. Now I don't know what I'm going to have. All right, let's run in here to the Dollar Tree because it is 82 degrees. It's starting to heat up out here now. So, all right, guys, I'll see y'all inside. Okay, my sweets, I'm here at the car wash and I'm getting a deluxe car wash today because my baby deserves it. So, let me turn this off so I can get through this little thing because y'all know it makes me really scared. <laughs> you see how he's instructing me to come through? So, I'll turn it back on when I get up here. Okay, so I'm back at my favorite place. And the deluxe was um, $20. I'm sure there was packs on it. Ooh, I thought some spray come through. What's going on there? Or am I just imagining? Oh, no. My window was still open. I felt a little bit of uh, water on my car when he sprayed my windows. <laughs> That's me. <laughs> Sadie, Sadie, Sadie. So, let me see if I can find a receipt. Hold on. Okay, my sweets, it was exactly $20. It wasn't no, it wasn't any tax or anything. Oh, let me I'll show y'all that. I'm gonna have to do that out of there. Yeah, it was exactly $20. So, wow. Okay, all right. I'll see y'all. <laughs> okay, they gave us a little free air freshener. You can get whatever fragrance you want while you, um, after you pay. So I got a strawberry. Not that I needed any more air fresheners, but free is free. Free, 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 free. <laughs> I'm not even gonna 
vacuum today because the last time I vacuumed, it's still good. So I don't even have to vacuum today. So I'm just getting the outside of the car washed and then I'm going to dust the inside of it. And then I'm going home making some lunch because I'm hungry. Rain repellent, the hot wax, and uh, it's not the top of the line. The top of the line is 25, so I got the one right under. Yeah, the tire shine. That's the one I got. Cause my baby deserves it. She needs to be taken care of. that window I can see clearly now the rain is gone do -do -do -do. she looks beautiful beautiful all right okay my sweets I'm here at Food Lion I decided to run in here real quick and see if they had any ground turkey because now I have a taste for spaghetti so yeah let's go in here and see what they got <laughs> Y'all see what I'm talking about? The regular, like 87 um, ground turkey is gone. Matter of fact, almost all the butter bowl turkey is gone. They got one half of lean here. And I think that's like $5, $4.99. But they do have the food line here for $4.49. And I think for an extra 50 cents, you may as well go ahead and get the good stuff. But I could have gotten this cheaper at a Walmart. Did they have it? No, they didn't have it in the small time. I don't think. Whew, I don't know what's going on, y'all. They had a regular butter bowl ground turkey on sale all last week. And every day I came here, they had none. I tell you, life is getting rough out here, y'all. Now they got the sliced watermelon again. The piece that I got from the other food line was really, really good. Um, but yeah, I'm still not ready to pay $3 for a uh, watermelon. This one looks good, but they want about $3 for it. And so then you come over here and you get the slices. And you gotta look through here and find a decent slice or two. That actually looks good. I'm not really sure. They're not looking as good as the ones that I got the first time around. Alright, let me go through this and see what I want. Y'all know I don't normally buy ice cream as much as I love it. They got the blue ribbon on sale for $2.49. And with um, your MVP card, it's going to be $1.99. I think that's a good deal, but I'm trying to decide which one I want. Chocolate peanut butter cups, Rocky Road, or chocolate fudge drops. Oh my goodness. Or just chocolate. I can't have vanilla as much as I love it. Uh, I think I'm going to try the peanut butter cup. It's yellow. Let's both of them together. Okay. Y'all see these new kinky cocktail drinks? Wild berry, mango flavored, mango passion fruit, blood orange. These look good. Then they have a kinky aloha fruit punch. Then they got all these up here, which you know, I don't really get into. I like the sweet drinks. That's why I'm a diabetic. Okay, I digress. Bye. Okay, my sweets. I am finally home. That's my sunshade up in the window. So try to block some of that sun. But I just came back on to let you guys see this little wafer. It's called a Wonder Wafer that you get for free at the car wash. Man, I'd rather have one of these than 10 Dollar Tree air fresheners. I'm serious, y'all. This little thing doesn't have a string. It's called a wafer for a reason. But I just opened the package slightly and sat it down here in my cup holder. Man, if we had smell of vision OMG. This thing is smelling up my whole car. It smells so good. Just like strawberries. Okay, I just wanted to share that with you guys. Alright, we're going in. Let's do a haul. Oh. Okay, y'all. Uh, I was just checking out 
how nice my car looks. They did the tires. See how shiny they are? It's hard to keep a white car clean, y'all. Let me get this grocery out of here and get this stuff in the house and then I will share the haul with you. Okay. Y'all, you know, I have to come back on. If you could smell this car, I'm all the way in the back. And if you could smell this car, it smells so good. Oh, I just want to go there and just buy their air fresheners. My goodness. I'm like, ooh. Y'all, I overspent. I went so well, so far over my budget. But, you know, that's typical what I do. But it's all good. Nothing here is going to go to waste. I just like to put all my stuff in my bags. So the nosy neighbors don't see everything that I'm bringing in. Because, honey, let me tell you something. They so nosy. They probably sitting back watching right now. But they can never see what I have. They can see me bringing my bags in, but they can't see what I got. So that's none of their bees, knees, beeswax. <laughs> so oh, this one goes here. Ugh. All right, guys, I'll be back. Okay, it's my trusty little pull cart. This is how I tote everything because y'all know sister got bad hips, bad back, the whole nine yards. So I'll see y'all back inside, okay? Okay, my sweets, I am back. Welcome back, everyone. If I forgot to greet you guys, thank you, thank you so much for all the love and support you show my channel. Uh, as always, I did not stick with my budget. You know, it's always in my head, which helps me a little get as close as possible. Okay. But I had a hundred dollars allotted for today's. Okay. I knew that my getting my car service was going to run me, you know, $60, $70, somewhere in between it, which it did. It was $63. And then I plan on using the remaining of that $100 and go run into Walmart's, just pick up one or two things, and then run over to the Dollar Tree, which I already knew the Dollar Tree wasn't hitting on much, and then go to Food Line and pick up, you know, maybe some more water or something. But yeah, of course, it didn't work out that way. No, it did not. I went into Dollar Tree, and yeah, they weren't hitting on much, but these are some basket bags that I got to make up some of my baskets that I'm planning on making. I got this tablecloth in the oblong size, you know, the shore living. I'm not sure. I bought it for my sister, but I'm not sure if she wants it or not. But I did duo her, like uh, FaceTime her while I was in the Dollar Tree because I really, really like that um, Two Less Fish in the Sea one. But when I saw this one, love you to the beach and back with the mermaid. Yeah, because my sister and I are so much in sync, I actually really preferred this one. And I didn't want to buy the wrong one for her. So I FaceTimed her. We call it duo, but it's just like FaceTime to see um, which one she wanted. And this is the one she chose, just like I knew she would. So I got her that. That's going in her basket. And then I just picked up a couple of these John Morrell Polish sauces. Y'all know they have the hot ones and they have the regular ones. These are really, really good for any time. I typically use these for breakfast. So I'm just going to put these in my freezer and just let them be there. Because y'all know meats, meats are, are sky high. Everything's sky high. Both of these don't expire until June 30th, 2022. So we got, you know, once you put them in the freezer, they'll be fine. Okay, let me put this away. Okay, so when I came out from the dealers, the first place I stopped off at was Walmart. And I went in through the garden center, y'all. Why'd I do that? Yeah, right off the bat, $6, $5.97. I bought these pillows in the gnome motif over the Christmas holiday, and they were all $5. They've gone up a dollar, so they're $5.97 now. But y'all know... I've seen this pillow in the background of other people's videos and wondered where they got it from and forget to ask them. But I had never seen it at my local um, Walmart. Not that I really looked for it, but I absolutely love this pillow. I just could not. I couldn't, y'all. They have pillows in that bin for $20, like Pioneer Woman. They were nice. 
I would pay twenty dollars for that Pioneer Woman pillow if I had it like that. But yeah, this is my beehive pillow that I just absolutely, absolutely have to have. This is an indoor and outdoor pillow. So yeah, was well, this outdoor throw pillow? But y'all know it's my mainstay. Yeah, I might put that outside. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> but I couldn't make up my mind what I wanted to have for dinner today. You know, when you're out and you're running around, you're getting hungry and your mind is all foggy. Well, mine's is foggy all the time. But I digress. <laughs> but I did get some great value, original premium sausage. It was the most um, affordable sausage because they were out of the one that was $1.99, which I don't know which, what it was, but this doesn't expire until July 1st, 2022. So I like to grind that up and put it in my spaghetti, use some of it for breakfast sausage. I also bought this one. I really, really don't usually like the, um, to buy the pre-cooked one already because you get so much less, but the uncooked one just like this from the same company was so expensive, y'all. I just left it right there. I got this. You get like uh, two easy, about seven slices each. So about 14 slices in here. Makes um, perfect BLTs. Y'all know I love me some BLTs, so I don't have to overcook them. So that's good. I got that. And then the uh, rotisserie seasoned chicken breast for some sandwiches. Yeah, it was two something. I don't have my receipt on me right now, but it was affordable to me. So I grabbed that. And then I got some mild taco sauce for when I do finally, finally make my tacos. I'm going to make a taco bowl or some tacos, something, because I got so much stuff in my pantry. But this is Taco Bell. This is Taco Bell. You made my day. Mild sauce. They also had it in the version of hot. And this is what I went in there for was my biotin. This is what I use for my nails, my hair, and my skin. And I usually always get the 10,000 MCGs. Um, yeah, so I had to really search for this. But I take one of those a day, y'all. And that's why probably my nails grow so well. And at my age, my skin is not that bad. So I don't know what to tell you about the hair because, you know, my hair is my hair. But... <laughs> I was really, really having some leg cramps early this morning. God let me sleep through the night perfectly, but around six o'clock, my legs started catching cramps and it did it about three times. I have the daytime ones, but I'm almost out of them. So I went ahead and pulled the trigger and paid probably $10 and some change for this because everything has gone up. So I used to get them for $9.99, but more than likely they were 10 something, but I didn't care. I got my Leg cramps for the PM, these are the ones that you just put right under your tongue and and they dissolve so they work almost immediately. So you get 50 tablets. So yeah, that works really good. I went ahead and pulled the trigger and just got ultra. Did I hear did y'all hear me say ultra <laughs> Pepto Bismol? Because I'm tired of buying these generic brands and I'm drinking them like milk and yeah. The problem still persists. So, yeah, I went ahead and pulled the trigger and just got me some Pepto-Bismol Ultra. This is two times concentrated formula. So, yeah, if anything happens, uh, yeah, hopefully that'll work. And the Reese Cups, you know, I used to get at the Dollar Tree all the time, but now at $1.25, you can get the just the two-cup one at Walmart's for $0.98. Cents. So, yeah, that's my little dessert after dinner or whenever I want it because I did um, buy some ice cream from Food Line. But y'all know, we'll get to that part. <laughs> but that is my walnut, my well, walnut, sorry, y'all, my Walmart haul. I'll be back to share my food line haul with you guys. Okay, my sweets, this is the last of the haul today. This is the food line haul, which I hadn't even planned on doing, but I'm glad I got it all done. Hopefully I can chill in the house for a few days. Well, no, I can't because tomorrow I have a doctor's appointment. But anywho, I digress. <laughs> I couldn't make up my mind what I want, spaghetti, tacos, I couldn't figure it out to save my life, you guys. So I ultimately ended up getting me a Red Baron brick oven crust supreme pizza. And it looks so good. I hope it looks and tastes as good as it does on the box. This was for something. And I was looking for the supreme 
two French bread um, pizzas and they only had the pepperoni, but they were the same price as the big pizza. So I just went ahead and got the big pizza because I can have this for leftovers tomorrow. I got my pan ready. I've got the oven on, heating up. So yeah, we're gonna have pizza tonight, y'all. Okay, that's good. And I found some, I don't know. This is Young's Wild Caught for Alaskan Pollock Filets. Uh, I'm hoping I could just put in the air fryer and make me a fish sandwich. Um, they were on sale for two something. So that's the only reason why they caught my attention, y'all. It says Grimsby, England, established in 1805. And it looks really, really good. So, I mean, I like pollock. I like cod. I like any kind of white fish most of the time. So, for two something, I thought that was a good deal to get four of the flakes. The watermelon today wasn't really hitting all much, but I did go ahead and get two slices. And I'm just going to cut those up and put them in a bowl and put them in the refrigerator. I didn't need, I had two sticks of butter already, so I just added two more sticks of butter. These are like $1.99, something like that. These are the salted ones, which is the one I like. Um, yeah, I haven't bought ice cream in a long time, y'all, but this is a closeout. I couldn't resist it. For $1.99, I got um, this ice cream, 48 fluid ounces. I was like, it's a quart. Um, I got the chocolate peanut butter cup one. Mm, mm, mm. Yes, please. So I grabbed that because that was too good of a deal to walk away from. I did finally just break down and get the food line ground turkey. Cause again, like I showed y'all in the preview and, um, they didn't have any of the butter ball. I don't know what's going on. Maybe they're having a hard time finding it. I did have this in my cart already. Cause I was thinking about coming home and making homemade pizzas I started to put it back, but I said, no, let me just put it in because they got nice long shelf lives on this cheese. This is good into September 4th, 2022. So down the line, if I want to make my own homemade pizzas, I'll have my mozzarella cheese here already. And I was so excited because the last time I went into Food Line to find my sweet potato, the Oritis sweet potato crinkle cuts, they were so expensive. I could not afford them. So today they had them on sale for three something or two something, almost three, they had them on sale. So I grabbed them. And there's much that looks like the bags are shrinking. I don't know. But anyway, I love, 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 love my Orida sweet potato crinkle cuts. I had to settle for the Orida season crinkle cuts the last time I went, which they were delicious as well. But I love when they're the sweet potato ones. All right, last but not least, I got six more jugs of my diet tonic water and finally found some distilled water. They had five jugs of this distilled water. And if I had some place to store that water, you guys, and I do, I probably should have just went ahead and got all five because here recently it's been hard finding my distilled water, but I didn't. I just trust God and I just got two because I have space in my home right now for two jugs of the distilled water. So that's it. I'm going to go out here on the patio, water my plants real quick, and put my pizza in the oven. And that is a day in the life for Sweet Sided Joy. I hope y'all guys enjoyed watching. I'll be back in a few minutes. Okay, my sweetest house, get ready to put my pizza in the oven. I wanted to show you how it looks when it comes out of the box. Doesn't look too much like that, does it? <laughs> I don't know. But I'm going to add some more of this mozzarella cheese on here. Just to give it a little, little something, something and see how it comes out. I'll show it to you guys when it's done. Okay, my sweets. I've got everything put away. I've got the pizza in the oven. And I'm going to go out here and see if the plants need any water. I need to cut that tag off, but I hadn't gotten around to it. Like I said before, it is a gorgeous day out. But it's hot. It's warm. And it's only going to get worse, so... Let me see if I can open this door. Okay, so here we are. The plants, I watered them earlier today, so they look good. I did drop some seeds in there. I didn't save the envelopes to remember what I put in there, but I know one of them was Sweet William. I got some down there coming up. We'll see how they do, because then when it gets hot out here, y'all, yeah, I kind of let everything go to the by the wayside, so. This still is not, you know, written in any kind of um, special, I got the Nomi things up there, like that. 
and I did put all those up there and I did find the um, spider cleaner from the Dollar Tree I just haven't had a chance to haul it yet y'all you know? but yeah that's gonna help me a lot to come out here and clean any spider webs that are around I'm still dropping little drops of peppermint down here hoping that's gonna help a little bit but yeah I got a little bit more work to do I sweep my patio constantly and as soon as I do the groundskeepers they come through and blow everything back up on my patio I still need to go through all this and see what I want to keep and what I don't want and you know donate or give away the rest of the stuff so I haven't even put out my new garland yet so yeah there's a little bit more I gotta do but for the most part I got it clean from the winter so we'll see how it goes all right, you guys, thanks so much for watching. I'm going to end the video right here because I'm hungry and I'm tired. But love, peace, and happiness. Sweet Sadie J coming back at you. Remember, guys, be kind to each other. The world is big enough for us all. I'm sorry, I was looking at that car. <laughs> all right, love you guys. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And everyone, have a blessed day. Bye.